and I'm Tristan, and we will be making lentil burgers. Okay, the little twist. We soaked one and one half cups of lentils for two hours, and I rinsed and drained them thoroughly. I'm going to mince two garlic, two garlic cloves. And I'm going to be dicing the, the onion. Montana, just a fun fact about lentils. Montana is one of the largest producers of lentils in the U.S. And then we will shred three small carrots, which ends up being about one, one, and one, one third of a cup of carrots. And a fun fact about carrots, one fresh medium carrot of handful of body carrots count as one full serving of vegetables for your whole day. We will now chop one fourth cup of cilantro, which we already did that, and this is one fourth cup of cilantro. While we have the oven preheating at 400 degrees, we are we are going to put all the veggies in and one tablespoon of tomato paste and a pinch of salt and pepper in the blender and scrape the sides of the blender as needed to get all the ingredients mixed together well. Then we'll have one half uh, teaspoon of salt. So now we're going to continue. Okay, so we need one full tablespoon of this tomato paste. And we'll just take one teaspoon to use. We now we now will have one cup one cup a cup one cup and um, half a cup of lentils. So lentils have
stick and place them around the sheet and kind of form them into a patty-like shape. Lastly, we will make the patties for 10 minutes, flip them over and bake them for 10 more minutes or until they are crispy on both sides. You can also cook the patties in a skillet instead of baking them. All right, our lettuce patties are done. Um, and we are going to make a sauce for our burgers and wrap them in this lettuce instead of a bun. For our sauce, we mix three tablespoons of mustard and four tablespoons of maple syrup. Then uh, we stir it. That should be good. Then we now, then we place a patty and spoonful of our sauce on the piece of lettuce. There you go. Now, you, now let's take a bite. Perfect. 